What's up, Star Wars fans? Welcome to another Black Series action figure review. Uh, last one of the last wave. It is the Phase 1 clone. I uh, sillily thought this would be the least popular, so I thought I'll just, I won't put it through in the order with the rest. I'll wait and I'll grab it when it's easy to pick up once they're all sort of out everywhere. Uh, how wrong I was, because this guy has been really popular. Um, it's been a really hard one to track down. Of course, army building. Didn't even consider it. Uh, Yes, I'm very excited to have this guy finally. Um, fingers crossed I can pick up another another one. I'd be happy with one, but if I can get another three and have a nice even four, that'd be sweet too. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited to check this guy out. Uh, he's got the new body, new articulation, uh, all that good stuff. So let's crack it open and have a look. All right, and here he is out of the packaging. Pretty cracking looking figure. I'm really into the new... Um, the new body mold that they've done for the clones now. Um, it's just such a tidier sculpt without the pins. Um, I think the helmet is probably a letdown on this one at this stage, but you know, it's going to open the door for the future. So um, I'll see what I can do to correct it a little bit. Um, so accessory wise, it does come with the big rifle as you see it. It's been used a few times. Quite a few times now. Uh, most clone troopers have come with it. And also this one here. Looks pretty nice. No extra detail or anything, but uh, you know, that's alright. So I will just uh, take the blaster out there. And I've actually got my original phase one clone here from way back in 2014. So despite the sort of paint incorrection on this one's visor, I actually like the sculpt of helmet a little bit better. Um, not sure what it is, why I like it a bit more. Um, probably the new one just needs to dunk in a little bit of boiling water and reshape and maybe glue it down properly to the head underneath. But otherwise, he's looking a little bit whiter, the new one. details looks pretty good solid clean nice movement in the elbows there of course the uh, butterfly joint in the shoulder there and that nice soft shoulder bell to help with that articulation as well so if you look underneath you can quite you can sort of see quite clearly up that guy's nose. So many boogies in there. <laughs> so we all know that uh, clones are coming, but uh, you can sort of see that it's not totally straight. Um, you know, the factory, I'm sure, the, whatever machine it is, just plonks, the, plonks a bit of glue on and just drops the helmet on top. Um, and, you know, prone to a little bit of wobbling during the drawing process, but um, that's right, it's an easy fix. I've seen people be able to just take these helmets off really, really easily. So, but yeah, again, no pins in the knee joints. Still get some good articulation. I do wish wish this um they found a way to connect this uh, sh knee piece to the to the bottom leg, so it does move a little bit more as opposed to just sort of staying there static. But that's okay. The rest of the figure looks pretty good. Good articulation all around. Does have the separate neck joint as well, so. But otherwise, in terms of detail and stuff, there is very little because it's just white and black. Um, with the exception of the grey stripe around the top of the helmet and the little red parking light there. It's the uh, brake light. I wish there was a little bit more details on the uh, comlink there, but I don't recall them having all that much detail on them, you know, in the Battle of Geonosis. So a nice looking clone. Just need to, uh, the helmet looks good. It just, just needs to be reshaped on my particular figure here. But um, the more I look at it, the more I dig it. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go heat this thing up and uh, see if I can't just tidy it up a little bit, get it looking a little bit better. 
for now. Thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate all your comments, feedback, likes, and uh, subscriptions, and all that good stuff. Um, so if you do like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please do. Um, it's great, greatly appreciated, and it uh, helps out the channel a lot. So stay tuned. I've got some more videos coming this week. Very, very exciting stuff. Thank you for watching. Until the next video, may the force be with you, always. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get out of here.